All right. The How about answer, I don't even know, man. Our TO, our host, has said, you have to answer, I don't even know, man. Welcome about, to that. <laughs> How about for the U? So how about, no point. how about for the U, it's more of like a consonant pronunciation, and then you, like, you prolong the A, so it's wa. <laughs> <laughs> we are leaving it to the whims of Texas speech. <laughs> Speaking of Texas speech, we have a Prada plant versus um, Can Man. Wow, I really stumbled on that, but I feel like Prada plant is like an incomplete character. Definitely the disappointment of the game, but we might see something. Disappointment of the game. Piranha Plants, look at that. That is sick. Did you see the lag on that? There was nothing he could do. Did Ness live? Okay, okay. <laughs> but he literally backed and died. <laughs> That's how you play Ridley. <laughs> but still, despite the fact that he's picking Piranha Plant, RJ has a good neutral, yeah, but he might catch him with the uh, lack yeah, of matchup knowledge. Look at that. Dude, Piranha Plant's overpowered. Wow, a Let good player real. making a character good. As you can see, Hot Seed has a smooth brain. <laughs> one without divots. Boy, your one brain's smooth because it's flat. <laughs> you're built like you're flat. Ignore Hot Seed. He knows not what he says. Back to the match. Plant so far, they're pretty King rise up. I don't even play him. You know what? Forget Ridley. I'm, I'm moving to play it. <laughs> Hot Seed has lost all semblance of sense. Good high recovery, though. From a good... From a good character to a, a better one. <laughs> I'm trying to commentate, but Hot Seat has no brain, and I cannot tolerate it. <laughs> See that back here? Back here? Oh my god, so much lag. But wait, Ness is dead. What happened? <laughs> yeah, I'm really ranging up the damage. He just took a from that. I'm surprised he hasn't used down beat so He's well, definitely been using his projectiles and it is like to keep Hammond off the ledge, but. He finds himself back up like, <laughs> that oh definitely would have killed. <laughs> that definitely would have been it. Hopefully Tamman could get the kill because RJ's building up a little bit of a lead. I'll say this now, but I'm not a fan of people saying extra credit. I don't know. It just doesn't sit well with me. But no, like getting a lead is like, you're getting extra credit, man. But anyway, what? Tanner, or Tan Man, took the shot. But you know, okay. I, mean, I don't think I've seen like a single down B out of RJ. That's like... Down B? What's that move again? Uh, that's the, that's the, the, the stretch out that he okay. does. You know, has super armor on He's it. He's playing Ness with projectiles, and that looks in his hitbox. I know, but I mean, like, you know, safe for, like, recovery. You know, like, just so that because Ness with recovery. I mean, it'd be difficult to do, but I mean, still. That's so something. Oh, there oh, it is. There, there it is. <laughs> there it is. Hammond making good use of the platform, but RJ getting, RJ getting the grab. Really good stall, but RJ <laughs> with the sorry. ideas. Uh, rough, rough. You know, it's been a little cheesy. RJ isn't playing whoever, but, you know, Tamman's slowly been inching up to a victory. Will he take it? Pac-Man. Pac Pac oh, DK out here. We have the DK. Okay, now this is like character on PSU. Oh, let's shout out to the best, one of the best songs in Smash versus Lore Keeper Zena. If you haven't played the Delta episode, you should. And if you are not going to, I feel bad for you. Anyway, and this is still the worst remix of it, but it's still one of the best songs in Smash. Anyway, I've seen Someone get this guy out of the commentator couch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. But you're like, that is so good. Shut up. Okay, Piranha Plant almost won. <laughs> I was about to say, I've seen his DK do pretty good, but Tan Man really. Oh, I, I, uh, oh no. Stop speaking. <laughs> you're killing him. Okay. <laughs> uh, Another backer will do it though. Oh, he went for the down air. <laughs> uh, Tan Man trying to get this quick game too, but you know, <laughs> DK DK has the platform and he has the um, the nerf ding dong. So even though it's a little nerf, 
I feel like RJ might have the inputs to do it, but we'll see. Tan Man is definitely is the shield pressure. I mean, geez, man. He is getting overwhelmed. Like Tan Man's definitely been no stranger to just taking advantage of this stuff. Like any yeah, mistakes, is, uh, any mishaps, he just combo there. He's just all over, man. I've seen that up here kill is like probably about 90 years to the top. It's crazy. And then I do this. Oh, he was ready for that stall. <laughs> Good patience. If he had jumped, he definitely would have died from the back air. Up air? No, he waited for the up. Ah, he got the DI and he's heavy. DI and heavy. Alright, good jump. Not landing on top of the Tan Man. Tan probably going for a grab right now. <laughs> no DI. Yeah, what it is looks like DI traded for that. He like, he should transition his weapon. Tan Man on the cusp of taking the tournament? Ha! <laughs> okay, he can definitely get the reverse fear with this I'm just thinking they need to go back to Rainbow Cruise like they did with my, my, my guy Default. <laughs> okay, guys, I, I've been using a bit of hyperbole here, but he's probably the best he's playing in our state right now. Yo, he's using my skin. Get off. Reset. Two, one, go. My fellow Inkling commentator getting offended. <laughs> you, you, I, I really am dressed like an Inkling. I won't deny. <laughs> if you go back a couple sets, you will see my Inkling brethren. But anyway... <laughs> This, this is his main, and really, RJ's a pretty good inkling. I, I definitely enjoyed seeing him at the Mechacon tournament. He pulled him out and did some good things, but not just counting Tanman. Tanman is a game from taking this tournament. That'd be really awesome, and... Uh, unfortunate SD, you gotta dodge that PK Thunder. There's been a lot of SDs from RJ, and Tanman's really not shy to taking advantage of his advantage. Taking advantage of this. Tanman has not had any SDs. He's had a couple, but... I don't know, folks. We might be seeing in the final game. Definitely good have, option for the um, for the roller. Seems to have pretty much almost, you know, I mean, like answers to almost everything that RJ throwing out at it. But I mean, who knows? RJ could have to download it. Too. That bear is big, though. But uh, ready, ready. see, Tam has been on the stalls, but RJ was ready for the stall and. If no, he's ready he for like it, he's a target. A faster reacting character. Than, like, I mean, Inkling's got better frame data than any <laughs> of the characters. Uh, uh, of course, the Gimp. That's but extra he, rough. <laughs> I feel like because RJ was doing that early with um, Isabel, that might have been intentional. But RJ back in the driver's seat now. That's really good. That killed. Wow. Wow. What the hell? <laughs> He did just respond, so it might have been fresh. The DI might have been that good, but regardless, this could be game stock. This could be it. Got him back here. A lot of pressure right there. Arjun's definitely been back here in a lot, but Tanman's just been going in with the bears. Definitely been working out for him. Oh! oh! 3-0 on after the bracket reset. Congratulations to Tanman. What a way to end it.